For this video, I'm going to show how to prepare a chocolate mousse. A little introduction um, to chocolate mousse. Chocolate mousse is also uh, one of the classic dessert that are used um, in fine dining. And it didn't involve any cooking. So important to have hygiene in the in the process of cooking because it involves raw raw eggs. So choosing a health, healthy and fresh egg is very important so that we could avoid um some diseases. All right, this is the ingredient for making chocolate mousse. First of all, one hundred gram of chocolate, four tablespoon of butter, four numbers of eggs one and a quarter of cup of sugar for egg yolk and lastly three tablespoons sugar for egg white okay first of all we're going to boil the water to make a to melt the chocolate we need to use double boiling so that we didn't burn the chocolate so we need to wait until it uh, boiling and then we could then we're going to uh, put it on top of the bowl make sure the water didn't touch under the bowl okay so we're just going to eat until it boiling as you can see there uh, the water is start to boil now we're going to put the bowl on top of it then we're going to put in the chocolate and also the butter okay we're going to continue the to stir it until it fully melt it's important not to let the water get into the chocolate because chocolate is very sensitive to water so making making sure that it's not going to get into Make sure that water didn't get into the chocolate. Make sure you scrape under under the bowl so that there is no chocolate left over. As you can see, it's getting smooth and all the butter is dissolved. Butter is no longer visible, so going to turn off the heat. Okay, next we're going to beat the egg yolk with sugar. So it's important to know which sugar for which eggs. So as you can see here, I'm already separated. So this sugar is for the egg yolk, and this one is for the white eggs. Okay, so first we're going to beat the egg yolk. As you can see here, it's become thick and lighter, so it is just nice. Okay, now that we're done with the egg yolk, we're going to beat the uh, egg white next. 
So, pour in the egg white. We are going to beat it until it forms soft peaks. So we are going to see how it turned out. As you can see here, it already has soft, soft peaks. So it's ready. Okay, now we have all the ingredients ready. It's time to mix them all together. First, you pour in the chocolate. Make sure it's already cold in room temperature. We're going to fold in the egg yolk. Make sure that you didn't uh, mix too much, but as long as it is mixed well all together, that you won't see any um, yellow streak that's when it's ready but not too over mix so that we don't deflate it okay now that it has no yellow streak left next we're going to put in the uh, whip egg white same with uh, how we do it you just going to fold it but not to mix it too hard because we want to have the um, the so that we don't have to deflate it that's the most important thing slowly mix it together Okay, as you can see here, it's all about done. Next, we're going to transfer it into the glass. Okay, so what I have here is a just glasses. You can use any type of uh, container such as ramekin or um, glass anything so it's done so what you're going to do is wrap wrap it So you're going to store it in the uh, refrigerator for about 4 hours until it's set. Okay, after 4 hours, uh, my dessert is ready to be eaten. And as a garnishing, I put a chocolate flake on top to enhance the presentation. Okay, after 5 hours of cooking in the kitchen, I finally done my, my dishes and as you can see in front of me, there are 3 courses, appetizer, dessert and the main course. So I'm going to introduce the appetizer. This is the uh, appetizer is orders, that is prawn, uh, salted prawn served with tuna, cucumber and crackers okay for the main course as you can see here uh, chicken roulette served with uh, potato fondant and vegetable salted vegetable and the uh, cream sauce and uh, mushroom cream sauce and then lastly our dessert is called chocolate mousse okay and now for the tasting I'm going to taste 
uh, the appetizers first. You can see here. Maybe I should get rid of the tail first. Eat it. See here. Mm -hmm. For me, it's not bad. It's not bad. Just get. We need to get rid of the um, steel, so it's easier for us to eat. Okay, for the main course. We taste the potato. Mm. A bit tough. So, good. The vegetable. Mm. It's nice. And the uh, chicken roll. Okay. You can see the filling. Mm. For me, it's okay. Just that the sauce is a bit thick. Maybe I should mm, thin thinning the sauce a little bit. That overall, it's fine for me. Okay, next for the chocolate dessert. Okay, as you can see it here, it's still solid, so it's good. Yes, good. Mm. It still has solid in it, not uh, to mm, not too thin. Yes, nice. Okay, um. That's all for me. Thank you so much.